guys, it's Kelly. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for tuning in today. Hello to all my new subscribers. Hello to all my returning subscribers. Thank you for tuning in. I am back at it again with another fashion DIY. This one is gonna be a little bit more chatty. Just a warning. Summertime is coming. Thank goodness. We are almost there. It is spring slash summer. And in the summertime, there's nothing better than throwing on some shorts versus wearing jeans all summer. But as a denim lover, I can never give up my jeans for the entire summer. So I'm definitely all about a good summer denim look. The awesome 2017 trends for summer 2K17 is Bermuda shorts. I do not know where that name came from. I don't know if they've always been called Bermuda shorts, Bermuda shorts, <laughs> but all the online retailers refer them to, all the online retailers refer them, oh my gosh, refer to them as Bermuda shorts. So we're just gonna go with that. It's somewhere in between a capri pant and like a normal short short. So it ends right at your knees or right above your knees and sometimes in the middle of your thigh. Sometimes they're like 20 bucks and sometimes they're up to like $45, which is a little bit too much for me. So of course I headed out to my local Goodwill, which I absolutely love. That's where I get all of my thrifted items from is my local Goodwill. And I picked up about five pairs of different jeans, cut them up, distressed them exactly the way that I like them. And I used a lot of inspirations from Fashion Nova's Instagram. And I also got inspiration from Posh Shop. I think it's what it's, Posh Shop. I'm pretty sure it's Posh Shop from their Instagram as well. So I will show you how to make your own DIY Bermuda shorts. And there's also some special bonus ones in there as well. Let's get started. For this first pair, absolutely died. Absolutely love them. I definitely um, modeled these after the ones I saw on Fashion Nova's Instagram. This is just a normal pair of blue jeans. You can see on the back. The brand is Tom Taylor. I actually have no idea what that is, but the quality was really good for them and they were only like $5, so picked them up. And I basically just took a marker, took a Sharpie, and drew these shapes and like these little slash lines down at the bottom. Went in with some scissors afterward, cut them out. So you can see they turned out like this. I did take a knife. I don't know if I'd use a knife, if I'd suggest that to use a knife, but I actually took my husband's knife and like roughed them up a little bit more. Then right afterward, toss them in the washer and dryer, and this will give you that nice little fluffy seam that you can see right here. And I think they came out really good. Love them, definitely gonna rock them this summer. The next pair actually started out like the color of the first pair, but I decided to acid wash them. Basically, acid washing is just taking bleach and applying them to the jeans. I literally folded them up before I cut them, just like this, and I placed them into a plastic container the whole thing with bleach. I swear that I'm going to show you, you'll see the difference between this one and that one. It's a little bit more yellow because I didn't dilute it with water. I suggest diluting with water so you can actually get this acid wash and not acid burnt because that's what I got before. It was more like acid burnt, but it still came out okay. So same thing for this one. I just did some slash marks with a marker and then I went in with that same knife and I just like cut it and went crazy and slashed it and they came out with this, threw them in the dryer. I also decided to cut up the bottoms a little bit and I just went like this, trimmed it a little bit at the bottom and then kind of just like fluffed it out with a tweezers and that came out really well. So this is the pair that I was referring to previously. You can see, I don't know if it can, yeah, you can kind of, it actually looks a lot more white on camera, but these are actually a little bit more yellow in person. I went crazy, didn't even look it up about really acid washing. I just knew that I had to throw bleach on the jeans and they would be fine. So I just took them and put them in a plastic container and doused these things with straight bleach, no water whatsoever. And it was literally, I wish I had the footage from it, it was literally steaming. If I can find it, I'll put it right here because it was steaming off of the jeans. I do not suggest that and I do suggest doing it outside as well because I started in my bathroom and I think I almost passed out. I might have blacked out, I'm not really sure, but hopefully not. But yeah, so this pair I actually did not distress myself. I threw them into the wash immediately because they smelled really bad and I was starting to make my house smell. So I threw them in the washer and the dryer and it actually came up ripped like this, like almost to perfection. I loved it, but it was just really kind of like luck of the Irish, if you will. I just wanna say oh my, oh my. Yeah. This pair is actually not considered Bermuda shorts, they're more like booty shorts. But same difference, um, these are actually jeans, they're from American Eagle. They were normal length, I cut them to shorts, I actually put them on my body and then I used a permanent marker to mark exactly where I wanted them at, like the exact length that I wanted them to be. And then I actually cut them in a V shape because that's another trend that goes on, not just like a straight across, it's actually a V shape. So when you put them on your body, they actually they have a V. 
they actually form a V on your body. My last pair, these are actually not shorts, these are more like boyfriend jean. They go to about middle between my ankle and my knee, I would say, and I called these the Kourtney Kardashian cut because I actually was watching Kardashians while I was distressing the other jeans. Another tip that I do suggest is put something on while you do this because it is a little time consuming as you're doing it. Put on a good show like the Kardashians. If you watch my videos, you know I love the Kardashians, so what better? And Kourtney was actually sitting on the couch talking to Kim about Scott or something probably and she had jeans that were similar to this so I literally just eyeballed them and like drew the squares like this and then cut it out, roughed it up with the same thing. You can actually see here that well, you can, I don't know if you can see it or not. You can kind of see, no, mm -mm. can't really see. But you can kind of see where I put the black marks and then I just like slashed it across again. It's a good time. That is all that I have for today. Be sure to subscribe, like, and comment. I love you guys. I will see you in my next video. Anything additional? I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. <laughs> That's the greatest part.